Life is too ironic. It takes sadness to know what happiness is. Noise to appreciate the silence. And absence to value presence. Those are true words. When you think you're all the way down the stairs, but there's one more step. I think the universe is trying to tell me something. Got pain? You deserve it. I'm not sure if life is passing me by or trying to run me over. Me, whenever I talk. What am I even saying? Life is like toilet paper. You're either on a roll or taking crap from some asshole. The summer of 2069 is closer to us than the summer of 1969. I'm not dead. This is just how I look. Same for me, plant. It's the same for me. The fitness trainer asked me, what kind of squat are you accustomed to doing? I said, diddly. I didn't actually need bread, but the only other items in my cart were a toaster and a bath plug. I didn't want the cashier to worry. I don't know about y'all, but I don't have any more passwords left in me. Me when I have to restart a song because the conversations in my head got too loud and I missed half the song. Don't talk to me after I hit my leg on this because I'm going to have an attitude when playing truth or dare at a party and someone dares you to go home. When you almost lose your but then you remember you're too pretty to go to prison. I've been putting a lot of thought into it and I just don't think being an adult is going to work for me. We do not check the refrigerator multiple times and hope to find new food. We check to see if our standards have dropped far enough to eat what was available. The anxious urge to say, eh, it's no worries either way, when you are actually worrying both ways, plus a secret third way. Ways to contact me. Text, email, direct message, skywriting, smoke signal, call. This is 100% true. Carrying my emotional baggage around while trying to hide it from others. That little scrolly thing to pick the year you were born is getting pretty far down the list. Me. I really need to start eating healthier. Me at 2 a.m. The lettuce in my fridge watching me have pizza for dinner. Hey, are you busy on Friday? Me. That entirely depends on the rest of the information you're about to give me. Starting your day with an early morning run is a great way to make sure your day can't get any worse than it started. When someone asks you, what's wrong? But nothing's wrong. That's just how your face looks. Have you ever been in an accident that resulted in your death? The light inside has broken, but I still work. Me too, been a machine. Me too. Freddy, after entering my dreams and seeing stuff he wasn't mentally prepared to deal with, when you find someone who has the same sixth sense of humor. I am very sorry to hear that the direct and predictable results of your actions happen to you. Me. I'm going to start eating healthy. Also me. Treat yourself one last time. You deserve it. I hate it when people text me. Call me. I call them and I'm like, text me. Then I hang up. When you finally make it to middle class. And inflation gets so high, it makes you lower class again. And this is getting worse every day, too. Just because you're trash doesn't mean you can't do great things. It's called a garbage can, not a garbage cannot. I want to run away, but I can't afford it. Here's a little life hack. Health insurance is cool because you get to pay a bunch of money each month for nothing. And then if something happens to you, you pay a bunch more. It's the same thing with car insurance. It's all just a legalized pyramid scheme. How do people stay in the house all day? All my stuff is there, and I don't like people. You're offered $50,000, but if you accept it, the person you hate most in the entire world gets $100,000. Are you taking it? Yes. Why wouldn't I want $150,000? My whole vibe is on do not disturb. I'm going to try to act like a normal, happy, mentally balanced person today. Wish me luck. I'm not totally useless. I can be used as a bad example. Them. How's life? Me. Everything is on track. Thanks. The track. Dating when you're older is like trying to find a cart with good wheels at Walmart. You just need a little WD-40. Me. I think I've had about all I can take. The universe. But wait. There's more. When you squat down to get something and you hear your knees crack. There are two kinds of people in this world. Avoid both of them. What's your longest relationship? 
Me versus the state of New Jersey. Me. Heavens above, please give us a sign that things are going to improve. The heavens above. We don't have any motivational quotes today. If you want to give up, give up. I came home and my dog peed a little because he was happy to see me. None of my friends pee when they see me. I'm surrounded by fakes. Jeez. <laughs> what the heck? Fitness instructor. Have you ever done a marathon? Me. Like on Netflix? I hate when people ask me, what did you do today? Like, buddy, listen here. I woke up at noon and then it was 5 p.m. Okay? I don't know. Goodbye, cruel world. When you thought life couldn't kick you any harder, some battles leave you breathless. When there's a deep rage burning inside you. But you gotta act nice because you're at work. Silence is golden. Duct tape is silver. People are getting their lives together, getting married, getting promotions, etc. Then there's me. Ha ha, this meme is funny. I should make an award for anyone who uses an entire tube of chapstick without losing it. Friend 1. I just bought my first house. Friend 2. Just booked a flight to Europe for a week. Me. I have three dollars. Me. I'm gonna give the person I like some space today. Also me. American healthcare be like, my stomach hurts. Doctor, you're lying. Anyway, here's your bill. $60,000. Me putting $20 worth of gas in my truck today. When you ask me how I'm doing and I say, I'm functioning, this is what I mean. Me in the shower trying to remember if I used shampoo. There is a part of Mount Everest known as Rainbow Valley. It's not named that because there's rainbows there, but because of the brightly colored jackets on the frozen corpses that litter the valley. You think people see that and learn. Remember to drink water and pretend your life is not falling apart. When someone remembers a small detail about you. When someone explains something to you three times and you still have no idea what's going on. Me in the morning after chilling on my phone for the whole night after repeatedly telling myself, just five more minutes. Live forever, but be depressed. Live a short life, but be happy. When you have to read the same page over and over again because you keep zoning out. Saying, have a nice day, to someone sounds friendly. But saying, enjoy your next 24 hours, sounds threatening. Me reading the messages via the notification bar and pretending not to be online. I'm not saying I told you so, but I told you so. When you get bad vibes from someone, but you can't justify your dislike for them because they haven't done anything wrong to you. That one nice friend when I'm cold. Robber in the middle of the night breaks into my house. My fat <coughs> who was just trying to get some milk. If you ever feel useless, remember, someone made a protective cover for the Nokia 3310. It was to protect the floor. Point of view, you were about to unalive yourself. But a meme cheered you up. I hope my channel can help someone get through each and every day. Point of view. Having an amazing day. My depression. What do we have here? This is where I would put my meaning in life. If I had one. A woman without her man is nothing. A woman without her man is nothing. Punctuation is important. And life is far more important. Me waiting for my crush to ask me out. 80 years later, when life gives you lemons, I built my own wall, brick by brick. I'll be alone, but safe. You are not illiterate. Go to bed, you'll feel better in the morning. Is the human version of, did you turn it off and turn it back on again? When your friend gets upset, and you get upset too because that's the kind of friend you are. Watching a learner driver practice their parallel parking next to your car. When everything's going wrong, but you're used to it. When you suddenly disappear from everyone's life and no one even misses you enough to reach out and see if you're okay. And you realize you've had no meaningful impact on anyone else's life. People are so busy these days it's easy to overlook something about those around you until it's already too late. Optimist. Half full. Pessimist, half empty. 2023, it's piss, isn't it? How's life? I'm not very good at it, but it doesn't matter. Saw a book called How to Solve 50% of Your Problems. So I bought two books. 
Idiot, buy one book and read it twice. I don't mean to brag, but mine was free. Anxiety Disorders, now only $45. Common sense is not a gift, it's a punishment. Because you have to deal with everyone else who doesn't have it. I'm old and I'm tired. Please do not play me. True words. My wife makes us put $5 in the find jar. Every time we make her find something we can't locate in the house. After 13 months of saving, today we're buying a Ford Explorer. Me in public listening to other people's conversations, which is obviously none of my business. Once you understand why pizza is made round, packed in a square box, and eaten as a triangle, then you will understand women. Sometimes I wonder, what happened to the people who asked me for direction? The look your mom gives when she loves you, but wishes you made better decisions. Listen, if drunk me said or did something, you gotta take it up with drunk me. Don't come and sober me, we weren't there. We don't know what happened. Every dead body on Mount Everest was once a highly motivated person. So maybe calm down. Never underestimate the power of stupid people in large groups. Ask Cole. A person who often asks for your advice, yet always does the opposite of what you told them. It's when you use reverse psychology. The day you realize your coworkers are young enough to be your kids is the day you're officially old. How have you been coping with everything? With sarcasm, mostly. Has that been working? Yeah, it's been super great. The fact that Head & Shoulders doesn't have a body wash called Knees & Toes disappoints me almost as much as I disappoint my parents. In elementary school, when we would read out loud to the class from the textbook, I would literally count the kids in front of me and figure out what section I was reading so I could practice it before it got to my turn and I think that's where my anxiety started. When your friend is about to do something stupid, but you kinda wanna see what's gonna happen. January, blink, December. Congratulations, you got out of bed. $100 is basically an adult dollar, especially these days. The spider on my shower ceiling watching me lose arguments to the shampoo bottle. When people tell me, you're gonna regret that in the morning, I sleep in until noon because I'm a problem solver. I appreciate the emotional honesty of this piece of wood. Do not lean on me. I am not stable. The inventor of glue. I bet if we melt that horse, we could use it to stick stuff to other stuff. Dude, is everything okay at home? Remember concerts? Okay, great. But this is a rug under a coffee table. When you finally get what you want, but it doesn't make you feel any better and just ruins your life more. Y'all ever just laugh at something really dark and just sit there like, what's wrong with me? This store understands how rough of a day people have. Energy drinks. When you want to be social, but don't want to leave the house. The first rule of the condescending club is kind of complex, and I don't think you'd understand it even if I explained it to you. Me pretending to use my phone at parties when my social anxiety kicks in. Me zoning out really hard during a probably very important conversation. Respect people who wear glasses. They paid to see you. I wish pets lived longer and life wasn't so expensive and cake didn't make you fat and people weren't idiots. It's called karma and it's pronounced ha ha ha. Are you okay? No, I'm done with it all. Come on, let's shit on people. You'll feel much better. Me, trying to get a handle on my life. Courage is knowing it might hurt and doing it anyway. Stupidity is the same, and that's why life is hard. When you see someone running for the elevator, but you press the closed door button anyway. What if slugs are just divorced snails? Yeah, Michelle took the house. I kinda wanna play dodgeball with random people who don't even know they're playing. No matter how hard you try, you will never be as cool as this duck. When you hear a short person say, when I was little, when you already gave it your all, and it's barely Tuesday. Me, deleting my post and story because my other personality saw it and disagrees. Never thought I'd find a table lamp relatable. My outside self, my inside self. I don't know about you, but I've thought about running away more as an adult than I ever did as a kid. If you fear change, leave it here. When you hear your name whispered in a conversation, I have no idea what's going on with my life, 
I'm just in charge of the fake scenarios. When someone flirts with me, but I no longer believe in love. Out of service. Motivational speaker. You can achieve anything you want. You have a lion in you. The lion in me. Today's inspirational message. We do this not because it is easy, but because we thought it would be easy. How I sleep knowing I'm the disappointment of the family. When your weird soul finds another weird soul and you're just two weird little souls having fun on this earth together. Anytime I have to talk to anyone on the phone. When you break something and you fix it just enough so the next person that uses it think they broke it. Some days I have to stay inside because it feels too people-y out there. Me explaining to myself that my future depends on myself and I've got to work to get the things I like. My friends, just order a pizza. It's not that hard. Me, hello, yes, y'all sell pizzas? Position open. I thought I was a good person, but the way I react when people drive slowly in the left lane would suggest otherwise. My new business cards have just arrived. Please do not contact me. When you're an introvert and you hear, let's go around the room and introduce ourselves. Dad, let's watch some TV. Also, Dad, three seconds later. A good relationship is when she is by your side during bad times to tell you that none of this would have happened if you had just listened to her. When you're trying to love people, but you're also an introvert and have boundaries. When someone tells me to do something that I was already gonna do. Well, now I'm not doing it. When you got nothing in common, but you vibe. Me accepting the poor life choices that make me who I am. May I please get a crumb of affection? When everything is going wrong, but you're used to it now. It is what it is. I've lost the ability to hold basic conversation. I miss the old internet. When if you had something to say, you just put some sad song lyrics up as your away message, and people would be like, Oh no, what's going on? And you'd be like, Nothing, don't worry about it. Me, I have to start eating healthier. Me feeling even the slightest amount of stress. I don't know what this dude's going through, but I feel him. You don't have what they call social skills. That's why I'm on YouTube sharing memes. Me, what a beautiful moon. Let me wear my glasses to appreciate this beauty. The phrase, money can't buy happiness, is such a baby boomer concept. Like, I don't want excess wealth to buy a gold-plated toilet seat, Karen. I just wish I wasn't crying because I can't afford both spaghetti and rent after working 40 hours a week. When you're feeling sad because you can't find meaning in your life. Just think of this windshield wiper. Brain. You forgot something. Me. What did I forget? Brain. I don't know. Relatable post. Please do not lean on me. I'm unstable. Thank you. Sometimes I read a text and think, what a psycho. Then I press send. Is it hard for you just to ask for some help? Me. When you don't answer messages, but you're sharing memes. You pressing play on one of my YouTube videos with a full plate of food. Finally, inner peace. Anxiety. Aren't you like worried? Me. About what? Anxiety. I don't know. Me. Oh my God, you're right. Me. I have many hidden talents. Someone. Like what? Me, I don't know, they're all hidden. Don't be a part of the problem, be the entire problem. Pessimist, half empty. Optimist, half full. Me, yay, there's room for vodka. Of course I talk to myself. Sometimes I need expert advice. This is me. Me putting my playlist on shuffle, but then skipping until the song I want plays. My dream. When I retire with my savings, living on a small island somewhere. That's the sad truth of it today. Someone giving me genuine love and affection. Me thinking I'm being lied to. When you try to fit in, but can't stop being awkward. The year is 2011. You're watching videos from 2011 on your TV or computer. And your mother just cooked you some 2011 food. Life will never be this good again. Every year that passes is worse than a year before. Me and the cashier waiting to see if my transaction will go through. Mom said, wash your dish. I said, what dish? I gotta remember this one. It's better than plastic wrap. Your crush is coming this way. Be cool. Me. 
every time I decide to leave my house, blend in with the humans. Where do you see yourself in five years? Me. I don't know what this dog has been going through, but same. When you see a cockroach, when a cockroach suddenly starts flying, when a cockroach lands on you, money can't buy happiness, you just don't have any money. Seeing people the same age as you, doing amazing things with their life, while you're like, me telling my friends mental health is important and they should take care of themselves. How I deal with my own mental health. Friend, are you okay? Me, yeah. Friend, but your posts. Me, someone just called me normal. I've never been so insulted in my entire life. Me, I'm going to be so productive today. Also me, when song lyrics hit you so hard that you don't understand if you're listening to the song or the song is listening to you. Checking the time on your phone, then checking it again because you weren't paying attention the first time. Professional idiot. That is what it feels like. When people ask me how life is going, when you're in deep, look straight ahead and keep your mouth shut. Things to do tomorrow. Get up, survive, go back to bed. My crippling depression, memes, me. Isolating myself instead of opening up because I feel like a burden to everyone. Best friend, why do you reply so fast? Me, bro, you're the only person I talk to. When everything is going wrong in your life, but you're used to it. Brain, I see you're trying to sleep. Can I offer a selection of your worst memories from the last 10 years? Level 1, venting by crying. Level 10, venting by faking a conversation in your head with someone. Level 113, venting by creating an intricate alternate universe scenario in your head where you're a celebrity on a talk show dramatically explaining the <laughs> you've been going through. Me thinking that I fixed my life just because I cleaned and set up my room. I gotta teach my facial expressions to use their inside voice. When people give me compliments, I feel like a vending machine trying to accept a wrinkly dollar. And it's just really frustrating for everyone involved. I've never related to anything more in my life. When you're 30 minutes into an argument and realize you may have misunderstood something. So tell me a little about yourself. Me. Not the best, but still good. When debt collectors send you a hundred letters. When you've ignored the laundry for weeks. Waiting for things to change after doing absolutely nothing to change them. Some people think I'm going crazy. The joke's on them. I went there years ago. Fell in love with the place and decided to stay. Me and every campfire ever. This is so true. When your life is aimless and you have no passion or big ambitions and you're depressed as f but still trying to act chill and go with the flow. The never ending story when I was a kid. The never ending story as an adult. Sure, I made mistakes when I was younger, but now that I'm older, I've learned how to make different, often far more serious mistakes. How it feels when you're sick and that one nostril clears up for a minute. When life tries to hold you back, but you keep pushing through. Me. Well, I just woke up. Time to be productive. Me to me. Stare at your phone in bed for an hour. When you're giving someone advice, but you gotta finish with. But I don't know, though. In case it ruins their life. I told my suitcase we're not going on vacation this year. Me. Everything is going well, and I'm finally happy with life. Crippling depression. Shout out to Netflix for being the only one that checks in on me every few hours. Are you still watching? Yeah, babe, thanks for asking. This is how close I am to losing it. Happy endings? There are no happy endings. Life is an uninterrupted series of humiliating failures. Me. I'll do it at 4. Time. 4.05. Me. Wow. Looks like I gotta wait till 5 now. When someone insults you, and it's actually a good one you haven't heard before. Delete the, I'll do it tomorrow, attitude out of your life. I'm gonna delete it tomorrow. Me. I'm finally starting to feel happy and stable again. My depression and anxiety. It's funny how all the trust goes away when you're looking for the remote. Are you sitting on the remote? No. Stand up. When y'all stop arguing and just start mocking each other. 
The perfect doormat doesn't exist when it already rained and even the garden doesn't need you. Relax, you won't even remember that after a while. Me, after three years, remembering everything. The therapy dog after I share all my problems. When someone is crying and you don't know what to do. When someone asks me about directions in the city I've lived in my whole life. Be useless so nobody can use you. Which gym describes your week? Write it down in the comments. Me after laughing at my own jokes. When you're fatigued because of your depression, but you can't sleep because of your anxiety. When your friend said they were five minutes away two hours ago. Me accidentally drops ice in the kitchen. Just kick it under the fridge. Studies show you already met your soulmate before age 21. Looking for where I ask for your opinion. Gives people advice when I can't even handle my own problems. When people sing happy birthday to you and you just sit there like... When you start to realize that the person you're hurting the most is yourself. Me on my way to make stupid decisions. Single and ready to get nervous around anyone I find attractive. Maybe you'd feel better if you got out of bed and did something. Me. Me after completing one of the 20 things I'm supposed to do today. Any minute now, the caffeine will kick in. Any minute. The human body has 7 trillion nerves and some people manage to get on every single one of them. Me. There's a big pot in the kitchen to wash. I should go wash it. Enter me. It needs to soak. 2020 appliances. Break within two years. 1970s refrigerator. I will outlive you and everyone you love. I am eternal. I am time itself. I have a freezer from the 1980s. Runs great. I finally found a use for the holes in my Crocs. Me. It's going to take me like 30 minutes to get there. My mind. Tell them you're five minutes away. Experts recommend leaving your apartment, walking into the forest, and never coming back. Me. I need to go out more. Also me every time I'm free. Going to a dark place if anyone wants anything. When you find a lit series that already has five to seven seasons, 25 episodes per season, and 45 minutes per episode. Well, I'm going through a bit of a rough patch. The whole year, actually. Or 10 to 20. Uh, that didn't come out right. I'm not talking about that kind of prison. Takes a single step out of bed after eight hours of sleep. You are no longer well rested. Me, trying not to be awkward. Person, nice weather. Me, thanks. Raising awareness about mental health. Mine is very, very bad. Thank you for reading. The optimistic approach to life. The pessimistic approach to life. Can't argue with that. When life is hard, but you're trying to be healthy. Yeah, that's not too bad. But just get rid of the green stuff. Tell me a little bit about yourself. Me. The world right now. Memers. This is an old meme, but uh, I think it's truer now than ever. When you're 12 beers deep at the bar, and some guy you've never met is now your best friend for the night. My guardian angel when they got assigned to me. No comment. Me. Just because I'm ridiculous on the internet doesn't mean I'm this way in real life. People who know me in person. Yeah, people would say the opposite about me. Okay. I just found out that I can overnight ship camel spiders to your house for 60 to $100. So, if you've done me wrong, you have 24 hours to get your apologizing done. If only I had the extra money to throw away. There's a couple people that'd be getting a gift this week. To the person who stopped the washer in the middle of my wash cycle and took my clothes out just to wash yours. Yeah, you're an a- <coughs> Unfortunately for you, so am I. You can find your wet clothes, frozen outside in the snow. Any problems? Come see me in 301. When too many people you know from different places come together and you have to maintain the personality you've created for each one of them at the same time. People who constantly point out grammar mistakes are pretty much jerks. Scientist finds. Just think. There's scientists that actually got paid for this. Probably with government funding. They could have just asked all of us here. We could have told them that for free. Remember, the only thing standing between you and your dreams 
Is your appearance, lack of talent, and general personality? My doctor said to get healthier, use a bicycle and cut carbs. I said, hold my beer. When your friends are depressed, Bible verses and memes. When someone says, are you aware your post make you look mentally ill? Spotting a beer when you're getting breakfast stuff out of the fridge. You son of a gun, I'm in. Every time I say, I don't know. And my therapist says, oh, I think you do know. You live in a society. I live in a prison of my own mind. Men lost at sea 29 days say it was a nice break from reality. As long as you have the essentials covered, it probably would be. When your life is falling apart, but you try to keep a positive attitude. My doctor told me to watch my drinking, so I'm off to find a bar with a mirror. Some of you should walk a mile in my shoes, because then you would be a mile away from me, and that would be fantastic. Keep the shoes. What if I told you, you should look both ways before crossing one-way streets too? Yeah, you better these days. People, are you okay? Me, yeah, no worries. All I'm saying is that the world was fine until y'all started drinking them seltzer beers. Me as a child, me as an adult. Sadly, I have to say this is true. What are your plans for this weekend? Me, I'm not mentally equipped to deal with the sound of someone chewing loudly. Begging people to act right. Detachment. When you sleep four hours a night and think coffee will fix it. Yeah, you do that night after night and uh, it catches up with you. My emotional support dog after one day with me. You ever clean your house every day? And still have to clean your house every day? Yes. No one can hurt you if you detach yourself from everything and avoid becoming emotionally invested in anyone. I'm starting to think Costco understands what we're all going through today in 2023. When you're trying to decide whether to go into work or drive across the country and start a new life. Life is like diarrhea. No matter how hard you try and stop it, the just keeps coming. You are my best friend because you are loyal and understand me better than most. I don't deserve you. There's a flat tire on this truck and it's carrying a load of tires, but none of them fit. This image reminds me of those who have many friends and the day you need one, no one comes to help. I'm suspicious of people who don't like dogs, but I trust a dog when it doesn't like a person. I can attest this is 100% true. I have seen it in real life. I had this personally happen to me. There was a quote unquote neighbor and my dogs did not like them at all. And even our cat would growl at them when they were driving by, which I've never seen a cat do that before. I'm not going into details, but let's just say they were absolutely right. Come on, come on. It's either one or the other. Damned if you do. Damned if you don't. Sure feels that way sometimes. Isn't it weird we have this little voice in our heads? Like the one you're using to read this right now? Uh, I guess I'm the little voice in your head since I'm the one reading this. I don't need Google. My wife knows everything. Sometimes you have to sit back, drink a few beers, and accept the you can't change. Just another brick in the wall. Never fight until you have to. But when it's time to fight, you fight like you're the third monkey on the ramp to Noah's Ark. And brother, it's starting to rain. I think we're at that point, guys. Happiness is when you realize your children have turned out to be good people. Spilling a beer is the adult equivalent to losing a balloon. When someone at work asks me how I'm doing today, if I was a bird, I'd fly into a ceiling fan. I farted. That's as close to me giving up as you're gonna get. You ever get that urge, Frank? 
It begins with looking down from 50 stories up, thinking about the meaningless of life, listening to dark voices deep inside you, and you think, should I? Should I push someone off? Freddy Krueger, after being in my dreams, you need to get help, my boy. You can't go on like this. Sometimes I like to flirt, just to see if I still got it. I don't, but I have coffee, so there's that. Not only is it not Friday, it's not even Thursday. My guardian angel be like, what's that idiot done now? When you finally see the light at the end of the tunnel, I found this perfect doormat. There is no reason for you to be here. This is how I feel when I'm drunk and I'm trying to go to sleep. Don't bother walking a mile in my shoes. That would be boring. Spend 30 seconds in my head. That'll freak you right out. When you need experience to get a job, but you need a job for the experience. I think that relates to life in a lot of ways. Remember playing Mario Kart and thinking you were in first place? Until you realized you were looking at the wrong screen and actually crashing into the wall? That's life. I'm starting to think the secret to real happiness is being too dumb to realize how terrible everything is. How to have fun as an adult. If you ever feel useless, just remember that Bing's top search word is Google. Try to remember the greener grass across the fence may be due to a septic tank issue. Sometimes the first step toward forgiveness is realizing the other person was born an idiot. You know when you tap a YouTube video to see how much longer it's got left? I wish you could do that to people when they're talking to you. Hey, I see you looking to see how much longer I'm going to be rambling on. I'm this close to losing my when your lunch break is over and you still have to work for another 30 years. Don't worry. I don't think we got near that long. A 109 year old woman says secret to a long life is avoiding other people. I believe her. 8 a.m. Too tired to think. Noon. Too tired to think. 5 p.m. Still too tired to think. Midnight. How do dragons blow out candles? Or you're sitting here on YouTube watching my videos. Some people are like clouds. When they go away, it's a beautiful day. Me posting the most garbage memes first thing in the morning. I'm awake and it's everyone's problem now. My entire day-to-day -day life summed up in two pictures. Kind of. Hey, I'll be there in five. You ready? Me. I love games like The Sims and Animal Crossing. Like imagine how you could decorate a home if you had money. I think that's kind of the point of a lot of games. To live a life that you don't have. Things I know. Where every single item is in my house. What Disney princess I'd be. Lyrics to 90s R&B. Useless movie quotes. Things I don't know. Why I came into this room. I don't want to say how often this is true for me. That sound when you close the cupboard and hear something fall inside. That's the sound of somebody else's problem. Then you sit back waiting to see who's the one that's going to open it. When asked what I did over the weekend, I reply, Why? What did you hear? Me. One more beer. Also me three beers later. The therapy dog after I share all my problems. When someone tries to insult you, but you're much harsher on yourself. Me. I should clean my room. Also me after picking up one sock. When you find a good meme and send it to your two friends. Well, I can at least share them with you guys. I lost the sixth book in this series. After two months, I finally found it. Are you financially better off than your parents? Are things getting better or worse, objectively speaking, for newer generations? That's a good question. Let me go upstairs and ask them. I pull up to pump seven. Okay, pump seven. Got it. Looks back at the pump. Still pump seven. Slides money. Cashier. Which pump number? Me. This is true. The tears of my enemies. 
This was the beginning of my lifelong anxiety. There's a lot worse things. What is the one rule that you live by? Me. Never trust the living. When your sarcasm is so on point that people think you're serious. Or more often when you are serious, but you try to pull it off as sarcasm. When someone you don't know calls you by your nickname. Sometimes life is all about perspective and attention to detail. My favorite hello and hardest goodbye. Yeah, not really. Me listening to someone vent and realizing they are the problem. Salesman slaps top of the water heater. With this bad boy, you can cry on the shower floor for 45 minutes straight. All my life, I have called it a cookie sheet. And today, I heard someone call it a cooking sheet. I'm questioning my whole life now. Things that annoy me. Feelings. People. Basically everything. I don't know why I started to make a list. Did you know, by replacing your potato chips with grapefruit as a snack, you can lose up to 90% of what little joy you still had left in life. It's kind of sad that we often use food as a distraction. The perfect door decoration. Go away. Go on, get. Sometimes I think. But then I forgot. Yep. What people think ADHD is like. Squirrel. What it's actually like. I'm doing 1,000 calculations per second. And they're all wrong. Having a meeting with my parallel lives to find out who is responsible for the <coughs> that's bleeding into my timeline. Sometimes I find a random screw laying around my house. And I just assume it's from my life falling apart. People thinking I keep their secrets. Me who has a short memory. Do you have any hobbies? I don't have a TV so I guess I could replace that with my computer. This is not life. This is. No, it's not. Like my grandma used to say, you might be poor, but you can still be clean. And like my mom says, you can usually tell how a person lives by looking at the inside of their car. And I have found both of these to be very true. Person. So you just look at memes all day instead of socializing? Me. It's a peaceful life. Everyone who drinks coffee in the morning is psychotic. You know what reality is, and you're still like, Yes, I want to be wide awake for this nightmare. Well, they don't let us drink alcohol before work, Dan. I don't struggle with depression. Like at this point, I have it down. I'm good at depression. The internet ain't serious about nothing. We'll be in World War III, and this will be the last meme. When your bro, who was a Call of Duty pro, dies on the first day of World War III. Years of academy training wasted. You know, the worst part is I've actually seen guys in this younger generation talking online saying that they're ready for World War III because they played Call of Duty. Sadly, I think they're gonna find out. Either because the draft is instated or when it comes to U.S. soil. It's pretty sad days we're living in right now, but at least we can laugh at the memes. Here, you look like you need this. I opened two gifts this morning. They were my eyes. Every day is a gift. And whether the day is good or bad, remember to thank the Heavenly Father for it. This is Acorn Stash signing off. Smash that subscribe button and check out my other videos for more memes stored in the acorn stash. I thank you all for watching and I hope this video has made your day a little better.